Hey everybody, at the Sand Sports Super Show 2018, I'm here with off-road legend Robbie Gordon, Blake Wilkie, Lindsey Geyser. We're gonna go show you guys some cool builds. Famous Brad DeBerti Hellcat G. He's uh, rocking the Maxxis tires, it looks like. Got the Method wheels going, always king shocks. Keep it king. Even the front lights look king. Like He's got the three bob mount switch, large claws. Uh, it's two of them in the front for a passenger and driver. An overall awesome build, man. It's great. Our buddy Brad DeBerti, local to the Central Coast. Cool with the bob mount in it. Race pack data is linked to the iPad. So the passenger can have all the data acquisition in front of him on the iPad. He can toggle back and forth between lead nav and that. So they have comms. We have it in a 64 Chevelle, I think we're building. I think that mom armor mounts in that. Yep. And then we're having it in the F100. We're building that'll debut all raw at the off-road expo in two Next weeks week, in the KC weeks. booth. Nice. Yep. Awesome. And then uh, we have it in the Ranger, the other Ranger we're building, the 95 Ranger. So okay. Mob so you love Mob Armor? Oh, absolutely. Love, it's awesome. Love Mob Armor. Good stuff. I'm here with Lindsay Geyser. Lindsay Geyser is another brand ambassador for Mob Armor. They rock all of our products and a lot of their pristine builds, like this Can-Am right behind us. So Lindsay, what is it exactly that you really like about Mob Armor products? We just love how reliable and how we can just put all of our products in and have no worries with it. You know, we can have all of our technology with us and go out and mob and have fun. Tablets and phones are becoming a necessity to have with you when you are out and outdoors going off-road, doing crazy things like that. So we really appreciate having you guys support us and this is a very nice building. Yeah, right thank you guys. We love it. Absolutely. Our brand ambassador, Mr. Darren Parsons. This is his uh, 1450 truck right here. He also happens to rock multiple Mob Armor GPS uh, apps in this vehicle, mounts, tablet enclosures, I mean, all of the above. Blake's an avid off-road racer. I'm sure a lot of you people may know him from Instagram. He's pretty famous. I'm more like a class fun driver. <laughs> class fun, got yeah. the class fun going down. Yeah. So Blake also is a, a brand ambassador for Mob Armor. He represents our products, he loves it. So I wanted to ask Blake, what is it that you really like about Mob Armor? I mean, we got the rugged radio system, so Bluetooth's always cranking, so, I mean, it's solid. Like, we could be mobbing and just literally change the station, turn the volume up, play live feed videos. It's like a GoPro app, actually, with your phone. Everybody has a phone, so now your phone turns into, like, a GoPro application type deal. But, uh, I mean, and the, the, the thing doesn't show any vibration from the car. Um, it's just rad. It's unique. It's, it's accommodating. Even if you're doing crazy things like this guy jumping 100 feet over at golf courses and stuff like that. So, again, we thank Blake for uh, representing our products and everything. We really appreciate it. And we hope you guys go out there and get your products and try them out. Thanks for the custom out. Thanks, dude. Yeah, appreciate it. No worries. Yeah. Shoo! So this is Tristan's Razor. Blast craft enclosures, so that way the passenger and the driver has uh, iPads that they can actually use to uh, for, uh, plug into the OBD2 sensor so he can have digital dashes, um, basically. He can hit all of his accessory switches on a tablet. It's basically uh, making it to where it's switchless. So you have no switches on your dashboard. It's pretty advanced and cool looking. Um, and then he also has two uh, mounts in the back as well. So the, the, not only the driver and the passenger, but the two passengers in the back can also have their phones right next to them for convenience and if they need to use it for anything as well. So it's a pretty cool uh, Razor all in all. It's an amazing build and uh, he's pretty mobbed out, I'd say. That's so cool. Sponge. My GPS that I was running for free running, which was the mob armor mount with the iPhone, and I stick it on the race bike and they continue on and finish the race, and it worked. You see, so you're saying mob armor helped you finish the race? Absolutely. It did. It made, yeah, awesome. it made it through the race. You did. And the mob armor also made it through the 500, no issues. Yes. It worked perfectly. 
I, I'm very Great. impressed with it. Thank yeah. you. During the Baja 500 free run in San Felipe area, um, I ended up crashing, went, went over handlebars, and basically just took a dive. Yeah. And the bike like went over the handlebars, like flipping in that wreck. It was so bad. Um, the handlebars got bent. The rear fender got tore off. Um, I had a fractured rib and a busted up shoulder. So but out the of all- The mount didn't get broke? It didn't. That's awesome. Yeah. Uh, we've been rocking mob armor dude for like four years now. We just love the diversity of it, man. We transfer it from our race car to our pre-runner to our chase trucks. It's just super easy to just swap it back and forth. We take rocks, we take dust, we take water, we take everything to that iPad mount. It works perfect, man. We love mob armor. Thank you. Love the product. I tell you what, it's been fantastic. Of course, we've got full communications in the car through our uh, headsets. Of course. Everything we do is Bluetooth. We're all listening to music. The mount holds holds the phone so firm. I actually flipped this car completely over. Nice. Never let go of the phone. Everything's hooked up. We pushed it back onto its four wheels. Kept on going. That's Love awesome. the product. I'm here with off-road legend Robbie Gordon. He's a... Uh, they're building and designing these Textron off-road vehicles. I mean, they're one of a kind. I wanted to uh, do a little interview with them and kind of ask them exactly the things that they're doing that are setting the trend, basically, because I have looked at them and I gotta say, these things are amazing. So Robbie, tell us a little bit more about this uh, Textron off-road vehicle that you guys are designing. Well, thank you. This is a car that I've been working on for about three years. I started with Articat. Uh, it's a pretty, pretty much a, a full build from not only chassis up, it was wheels, it was geometry, it was spindles, it was seats, seating position, roll cage, chassis design. Uh, belt design, gearbox, brakes, motor, steering, Everything. Um, pretty much it's a, it, was a, it, was a, <laughs> it was a redo uh, because if we were going to make a difference in the category and really come and compete with Polaris and Can-Am, um, you know, we had to do something different. And, you know, one thing pretty cool is I remember when Polaris once told me that they didn't need me anymore because they surpassed all of my engineering abilities. I promise you, when we go head to head with them this car, it's game over. actually got mob armor in there. And this really beautiful Ford Bronco has our T2 enclosure in here for the iPad Mini. Check it out.